All right, hello, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies. Today I made two hundred and fifteen dollars, I think. Um, yeah, close PL two hundred and fifteen dollars. Uh, I traded PTIE and bought five hundred shares at six dollars and eleven cents. Sold that at five dollars and fifty six cents. Um, this is not actually where I wanted to get in at. So we'll go over it right now. But um, so I wanted to get in at 590, which is the break of this pre-market high. As you can see, there's a little resistance here. That's why it kind of fell back down. But it did, it ended up did breaking it. And uh, my hotkeys are kind of messed up right now, I guess. But um, I, had, I have to fix those like after this video because I can't keep trading like this. Anyways, I put what I put in this order right here was 590. So I put 590 300 shares, but I pre uh, my hotkey is um, order entry, buy and prove. I, I placed a limit order to buy 500 shares. So originally I wanted 300 shares, but I ended up buying 500. Anyways, uh, I gotta fix that. So I, buy, I wanted to buy at 590 and for some reason, I don't know why, but it filled me at $6.11. $6 and in this case, yeah, I made money, but it's not really a good trade. Because um, that's like that's, yeah, that's twenty one cents off of what my entry was uh, originally supposed to be, or I want where I wanted to be, and uh, I'm not really sure why that happened. Maybe I was a little late, and this gap I just went up pretty quickly. It it did go up pretty fast, and uh, but anyways, I bought in at five eleven, sold in this next minute. Um, as you can see, I bought at ten thirty or nine thirty. Sold at 9.31, 31 seconds in. So I was sold in this next minute at almost the high of this candle. So that was pretty good at, at that time. At that time being, I did pretty well. And um, you went up a little bit higher and then pull back. And then start pushing up even higher. Pushing up, pushing up. It's, it's getting kind of choppy. When you see long wakes like this, that means it's getting a little choppy. A little war going between buying and se selling. But man, did I tell you one thing. I missed out on this one. I could have made really good money. My second trade of the year. Two for two, by the way, of the year. Um, both green days. I haven't traded. Uh, I didn't trade all last week, except for Monday, I think. But we're back. And uh, hopefully we won't miss another day anytime soon. But anyways, look at this trade. Oh, yeah, I made 7% on that trade. But uh, any, this, this thing uh, pulled back a little bit. And then... As soon as this broke, like this this little pre high of the day, our pre high, our pre high of this candle, seven bucks, we'll say. Yeah, uh, the next thing you'd look for is a an exit or uh, maybe even add on your position at seven thirty six, because as you can see, there's little resistance right here. These both touched the seven forties area, the seven thirty fives area, and uh, it fell down. That's why it pulled back. But this boom broke broke through this, went all the way up to eight dollar. Uh, the, the high is eight oh five. So the low is 698 and went up to 805. That's over a dollar in less than five minutes, about five minutes. So it gets halted. And a halt is uh, when a stock actually gets, uh, it's paused and you can't trade. You can't like buy or sell it because the company is not allowing you. The company has to, has to answer some questions on why it's going up so high so quickly percentage wise. And uh, once those an questions are answered, they'll get unhalted and we'll resume either at a higher or lower price. In this case, it's a higher price. That resumed at 4.45, and um, or 4.49, and then look at this, all the way up to $12.23 before you even get a pullback, before a real true pullback comes in. Look, you could have bought down here at the break of these the 736 area, like I was saying, could have made so much money here, but can't get greedy with this game, really. Um, like I said, I honestly, I probably shouldn't have made money on my first, that trade because uh, my entry was wrong, and um, it actually tested my exit, my exit strategy, but it never broke it, so I held on and made a couple hundred bucks. Anyways, boost all the way up to $12.21 falls straight down look look at this from from 1035 to let's say 1038 three minutes 
this thing went from $11.87 to $10.20. That difference right there is wild in three minutes. So then it, it bounces off that really huge dramatic drop, consolidates a little bit, gets a little choppy, tries to push up through uh, up to $11, doesn't get there, pulls all the way back, consolidates, and then boom, shots right, shoots right back up to $12.80. And then after that, it's, it starts pulling back and consolidating. Stays in this channel right here, but $12, about $12 to $11. Um, like I said, I could I would have traded this a little bit more maybe if my hotkeys were on point. But um, I don't know. I didn't really want to risk my, my um, messing up my hotkeys and stuff like that. So I'm going to get those situated after this video. But uh, that's the only thing I traded today. And... Uh, I mean, I could have done a lot better. Like, I just got 7% out of 150%, 160%, 170%. But it's it's whatever, you know. You, you can't kill them all. Base hits, not home runs, you know. Um, yeah, oh yeah, by the way, I'm doing another, another drawing because that dude that won it yesterday in my video, Spaz, like, I don't, I don't even know who that is really. He hasn't contacted me either, so... I'm wearing my robe right now too. It's nice and comfy. Just got out of the shower, but um, yeah, I'm gonna. All your guys' names are in this hat next to me, and I'm not looking. Look straight in the camera. But um, we'll see who wins it this time. Oh, Jordan Martin. Can you guys see that? Jordan M. Jordan Martin. Uh, I know you personally, so I'll just message you or whatever. And I can either like send you money through PayPal or I can just actually send you a gift card through the mail since you live back in Illinois. But all right, uh, if you guys could just like, share, subscribe, give me some feedback. And um, if you guys need have any extra questions, just add me on Facebook, Romeo Medina. I will add you back and we can just talk privately if you want. If you don't feel like leaving a uh, comment, talk privately and I'll try to teach you as much as I can. I guess I remember I'm still, I'm not a beginner, but I'm like an intermediate trader. So uh, we're on the road to becoming a professional in 2018. And hopefully we'll make some good money this year. So I'm going to go ahead and fix these hotkeys situation. And uh, we'll be back tomorrow, bright and early. And uh, hopefully we can make some more money. Like I said, two for two for this year. I only traded two days. Oh, yeah. Um, where's it at? Two for two. So what's today? The ninth. P-I. P-T-I-E. 200 and, $215. Whoa, not that I wish. Entry. At what was my entry at? Um, Six eleven. Fuck, can't see. Six eleven. And then close my position at six fifty six. It's all under a minute. See, so yeah, as you guys can see, I didn't trade these days. Uh, yesterday, I couldn't. I wasn't here in the morning. But these other days, my bank and uh, my bank and uh, what you might call it, my broker weren't on the same page. I almost lost like five grand out of, just out of thin air. So my that was, that was that day. My vibe was kind of killed because I couldn't wait for the new year. So I didn't trade these two days, and I kind of reset my mind because uh, a lot of this is uh, emotional stability, and you can't be get too high, get too low. Like today, I'm, I mean, I, you know, up two hundred dollars, whatever. But uh, <clears throat> same thing if I'm down two hundred dollars in a day. Whatever, you know, every day is a new day. Uh, make sure you have that profit loss ratio there. My profit loss ratio is there and my accuracy is there. So far, both of them are doing well. I mean, still early too. To, um, two days into the year. Well, for me, two trading days into the year. Uh, go listen to this song, by the way, too. Lil Wayne's the fucking, the GOAT.
All right, so uh, thank you. Please like, subscribe, leave comments. And um, we'll be back tomorrow morning early. And I'll post another video of what I traded. But uh, Jordan, I'll, I'll message you as well directly. And we'll get that $20 situation uh, figured out. Um, also, we're, how many subscribers did I have? I think like 60 or something like that. Whoops. 60 subscribers. Uh, there will be another, gi another giveaway to 100 subscribers. So let's go ahead and get to 100 subscribers. Let's get to th this to 400 views, 100 views, 50 views. And then this, one, this video obviously will hopefully get to 50 views. But uh, all right. Thank you guys for watching. And we'll be back tomorrow.